our entire life only is open intelligence. You know, we, we walk around and seem to perceive people, places and things or maybe internally, you know, we have all kinds of thoughts, emotions, sensations going on. <clears throat> and um, upon examination, where is all this happening? Is it really happening outside? In your direct experience, maybe we're all dreaming. Maybe you're all that is and I'm in your dream right now. <laughs> we wouldn't know, would we? Other people say we live in a computer simulation, like literally. And then there are these long debates on how would we know? How can we prove it? Interesting for, for some, maybe not for you. I quite enjoy these excursions sometimes. But in the end, upon final analysis, fruitless. All right, so we've spent an hour thinking whether we're in a computer simulation or not. And then what? What's What's... What's it useful for other than that hour of speculation in itself? And that's another beautiful feature of the balanced view training is it immediate benefit. Each sharp moment is immediate benefit. And in this way we come to see that every moment is immediate benefit simply by relying on what's always count honorable, by relying on open intelligence. And in that way, we step up into a role of leadership of self, into a role of leadership of r really a leadership that is so exalted that uh, it, it doesn't even need to be named leadership, as in leadership of something. It is a natural self-expression that we have mastery, something that like sounds ridiculous that anybody could make a guarantee. But this can be made into a guarantee. We can have complete mastery of mental and emotional occurrences of every moment in our life. We can't control what happens in our life, but we can master how we respond. Once introduced to open intelligence, the search ends. And it is important to honor that for ourselves. Because there will be times when open intelligence does not fit the concept we thought open intelligence would be like. Because although we understand that it includes, contains, pervades, subsumes, we, you know, I learned an entirely new range of words in this teaching, but I was still sure that it would not subsume, include, <laughs> and pervade like depression, fear, anxiety. What else? Well, many. We could make a long list of things here. But basically all the things we try to push away that we try to not have, indulge, avoid, replace before, they will all keep coming for visits. And they will keep coming for visits until we let them in and clarify them in our house of open intelligence. So, the, although the, the introduction is often a quite memorable point, you could say, in our life. It isn't, it isn't the end of open intelligence as benefit creation. It's the beginning. And from there, there is an inexhaustible opening. It cannot be exhausted. We're never done or finished. We are done and finished with confusion. We can never go back to forget the introduction to open intelligence, even if we try really hard, like if we're on the search for the long lost mother, and we, we really try really hard to go back to live in the dream world, we'll always know in the back of our mind that this is not where we belong. 
<laughs> we'll always know that. So eventually we come back anyway. That's the recommendation is to just do it right away rather than wandering around in confusion for longer than necessary. That's why we have the wonderful four mainstays. Always somebody there. Always a teaching at hand. Always a video that we can watch a book to read, a text to write out. 24-7 life support. Whatever it is that we that we would like. But uh, yeah, to to honor that moment of introduction with an ever-increasing 100% commitment. 100% in an expanding universe is expanding. So 100% commitment uh, is, is always more. And it always gives more energy. It isn't more work. It gives more benefit all the time. Just opening inexhaustibly. Such is the introduction initiating instinctive open intelligence, which is the pervasive potency equal to beneficial qualities and activities. The introduction to open intelligence equals beneficial qualities and activities. It boosts our range of skillful means into a completely different field or sphere, world where before there is only cause and effect thinking, cause and effect relating, we become increasingly spontaneously beneficial. Knowing what to do, how to be, without any effort, without any forethought or afterthought. with diligence, easily and potently enjoy short moments of open intelligence repeated many times until it becomes continuous. Rest deeply in the power of great benefit. <laughs>